The second situation we talked about that can be worked on weekly in practice is the punt after a safety. It's a very unique play. You don't see it very often, but if you're sent out there in that situation, you know your team's already in trouble and you need to dig them out of a hole. The line of scrimmage on a punt after a safety or a kickoff after a safety is the 20-yard line. Now, that doesn't mean you can punt it on the 20-yard line. It means you have to contact that ball behind the 20-yard line. And when you hit the ball, your whole cover team, which is usually the kickoff team, is behind you. When you hit the ball, that's in essence the line of scrimmage. If you decide to hit it at the 19 or 18, that becomes the line of scrimmage, and the cover team has to be behind that. What you need to do is talk to your coach, practice this. This needs to be a practice routine, whether it be the kickoff team or the kickoff team with a punter in the ball game. This is something that should be practiced once a week. First thing you need to do in your setup is find a spot when you run on the field where you need to start. This can be either predetermined during the week in practice or you can do it on game day. For me, it's about four yards, so I know when I catch the ball and do a dry run, I'm contacting that ball behind the 20 yard line. Don't just go out there blind not knowing what you're trying to do. After you've got that distance down, you're gonna let your kickoff team cover guys know that you're ready to go by getting in your stance and raising your hand. When you're ready to go, all you're going to do is hit a nice punt. We're looking for maximum height and maximum distance. This has got to be your best ball. Like I said earlier, you've got to dig your team out of a hole here. Maximum height, maximum distance behind the 20-yard line. Give them something to cover.